Hey guys, crew of Bonway back. I'm Calvin. I'm Rick. Shane. And we're back with The Witcher. The Witcher. Ugh. Last time on it's The Witcher. It's so hard to wait. Yeah, it was, it was really <laughs> tough to wait. I wanted to watch it with Carmen. <sighs> last I had to wait. Week, last week I saw something I never thought I'd see in live action. Geralt versus the Striga. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it was just amazing. The story behind it and just, I mean, the, just the effects, the choreography. It was glorious. It was awesome. Yeah. And, and the intercut between Guinefer and her transformation. Yeah. Uh, it was disturbing. That was disturbing. And beautiful. It was, yeah, it, it, yeah, I guess it it's the best poetic. way. It's It's the best way to put it. <sighs> Ooh. And just because of music and back and forth, just, yeah. Mm -hmm. And just having the Witcher in live action. And like Rick said, uh, it's like this monster turning back into a person and this person turning into a, a monster, even though... Yeah. Like, she's becoming beautiful, but we know on the inside it might not be good. Yeah. She's becoming what she wants to be, which is a weapon, basically. She's making herself a living weapon. Selfish, power-hungry. Yeah, she forced her way onto the account or onto the... Yeah, whatever it's called. Uh, the court? Yeah, forced herself on the court. Yep. got with that king that he was trying to... They were trying to set him up with someone else who wasn't yeah. an elf. Yes, um, king of... Adoran, I think, yeah, is where she is heading off to. And Siri. And the dude he was banging, she was banging dude. He got. I mean, he's gonna be. I mean, there's no way he's gonna get that anymore, dude. He said that shit to her, and then she got beautiful anyways. Why yeah. the hell would she go back to him? You know, time may pass. Who knows? You're right. Time, yeah. but who knows? Time. I don't think it's gonna be a short-term thing. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I, I can't imagine he. You know, they stay together after he said that to her. Well, yeah, I don't um, think she has Also, any... I think she's just going somewhere else entirely, too, yeah. so... Well, and she's also probably going to use her seductive charms to further her position in the New Kingdom yeah. as well. I feel like this is one of those yeah. times where, well, like... she said. You know, there's a couple in high school, and they have different ideas about what life is supposed to be, and they, they break up, and she goes to college, you know, kind of he thing. He becomes a laborer. A he, he like betters himself and she comes back into town for some reason and they fall back in love or some shit like that I don't know it's like that it breaks my heart <laughs> what's that song called huh uh, is, this, is it Halsey and who is it Halsey baby hold me closer and look back see her oh yeah I don't know but that's not toss a coin to your witcher and therefore I do not like it nearly as well yeah we yeah. also saw Siri walking into the forest mm -hmm. and we know that they are at some point destined to meet and her, her elf friend, Dara, is dead. Yeah. Everyone she's ever known and loved. Dead! Warning arrow. Dead. One. And now he's... Oh. Ooh. I thought she was doing the thing like Antoine did. The forest. <laughs> the bush just moved out of the way. Is this like the heart of the forest? She's heading towards the light. Don't head towards the light. Oh. Amazonians! Gypsies. Pointed ears. Do they? Mm-hmm. Not yeah. like elf pointed ears. The other elves we've seen were more subtle as well. You want all these title cards and medallions. Is that like a tree of broken you know sword? Swallowed that witch whole this is brilliant. <laughs> hey. <laughs> oh, sorry. It's just Geralt's usual. <laughs> I saw it, Michael. See? <laughs> 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 Need some new clothes, man. Toss a coin to your witcher, a valley of plenty. Whoa. Toss a coin to your witcher, a friend of humanity. Spreading the propaganda. Rivers of the sweetest of drinks from the rarest of. Who women and wine, Geralt? Who can say no? Now the boorish grunts of protest. You need to, like, get out of that right after and then get a new one. Because there's guts and shit in there, dude. Got to real quick. I'm not your friend. Oh, oh, really? Oh, you usually just let strangers rub chamomile onto your lovely body. Oh, yeah, that face. He's such a good dandelion. Gotta scrub that hair. Yeah, so you gotta clean that hair, man, before it dries. Crotchety and cantankerous. Anyway, you're not going tonight as a witcher. 
he hates dressing up. So Jasker. I think I I've seen him in different outfits and pictures of the game. Right, so stick close to me, look me, and pretend you're a Jasker, I think, is the Polish name. I think it translates Jester. to Dandelion. Oh, okay. Uh oh. So this is earlier. Yeah. I was gonna say. Yeah, this makes more sense now. Come with me. This explains some of the questions I had before. So the stuff with the Bard is a prequel? Like, Things Lays Before? Before the stuff with Siri. Sorrows on me, eunuch. <laughs> <laughs> that disdainful look down. There she is. Oh, okay. That makes more sense. She was a badass. In your mother's blood, you'll be fine. So one was the princess and one was... I thought the queen liked her husband. It seemed like it. She, she does, but th this is Siri's mom that's getting married. I was running. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I hope he lost the arrowhead, man. Oh. Hydrogen peroxide. The butcher of Blaviken breeds utter nonsense. <laughs> Perhaps the lords encountered rare subspecies of manticore. <laughs> Tell me, how does a witcher find himself at my daughter's wedding feast dressed like a... I'm protecting the bird from the vengeful royal cuckold. <laughs> <laughs> Lord Peregrine of Nilfgaard. <laughs> so petty. I'm one of five brothers with no sisters. My potent seed inside the better will produce the strongest of male heirs. So it matters. Sintra is indeed the jewel of the north. <clears throat> Yet Nilfgaard remains a shit rag of the south, and that's saying something. This came to bite them in the ass. If kings don't remain <laughs> kings for long, they will take the usurper's crown. You? No more than a fleshy contraption for squeezing out birds. Bastard cares more about his hands than he does about Rafa looks great! Yeah, it's cool. <laughs> Watch your heads. Oh, it all looks great. Love blood on the snow. Look the trails. Oh, he's uh, he's got some ingenuity. Portal time. This is fucking cool, man. Yeah, it looks great. Oh, you're fucked. It's like some giant fucking cockroach. What did they can give you that could be traced? Maybe it's a baby. Yeah. <laughs> that looks so good. <laughs> Teleporting's kind of shitty. I can imagine, yeah. Yeah. I'd be ripping all my clothes off, dude. You know what I'm saying? Earrings. How could you not foresee this? You're supposed to protect me. It's the baby. He's tracking the baby. Oath prevents me from revealing my face. He is cursed. This is no monster. I warn you. <laughs> this knight has been cursed. You are as useless as the rest of them. Right is the Sintra! That I come to claim what is rightfully mine! Pavetta! By the law of surprise. Ah. She makes him stop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Just getting involved. Ah. Oh. <laughs> 
This looks amazing! She got instead of the baby. Yeah. No, yeah. oh, maybe not. <sighs> no. Well, babies probably aren't built for teleporting. Yeah. That sucks. I told you to stay away. He's <laughs> like, I have to. You'd have to kill everybody here. You know what I mean? You didn't kill him, so they won't find out. He's a hell of a warrior, though. He's a knight. Until destiny intervened, and our hearts collided. <laughs> She's so disgusted. Is there not a man amongst you who does not cower before destiny? I just like, yeah, sorry. <laughs> Shouldn't have done that. She tried to stab him again. She looks just like their mom, doesn't she? Yeah. A lot, yeah. It's great casting. Yeah. She's like, oh fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> He's like, well damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Why does that affect why does that affect her? Huh? She's pregnant. Yeah. <laughs> and now we're back. Divination. Yep. So has everything with Geralt been a flashback? Hmm? Everything with Geralt been a flashback? No. So many awesome shots this episode. Yeah. Great yeah. locations. Yeah. Whoa. Oh, shit. Dude, that was a, just another hell of an episode. Yeah, a lot happened. I feel like I understand the show a little more, too. I think I'm starting to get it a lot better. Yeah, it was a little confused before as to the whole um, the lot of surprise thing of like why hadn't that happened yet oh okay um, when they were talking about going and find Geralt but now it makes sense they're flashing back and forth between right. time okay so yeah the, the, the lot of surprises like the biblical thing mm -hmm. where it's the first thing you see when you get home except instead of that where it dies or is taken from you it's you, you're granted it okay yeah so like they were saying, you know, it could be a dog, it could be a tract of land, or it could be a a princess. Man, if someone was trying to be a dick about it, it'd just, like, cut their eyes out. <laughs> just go blindfolded? Yeah, just go blindfolded. And have someone, line. like, going with you and taking it off at the right moment. Yeah. Or yeah. it was, like, a Mercedes or something. Um, <laughs> if I saw Pavada throwing up after all that, I would think it had something to do with the magic more than... Yeah, it looked bluish. ...a pregnancy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. That, that's what I thought. <laughs> I thought because of what the Witcher said, it made her do that. That's what I thought. Yeah. But now she's definitely pregnant, and they're 
Destiny. I mean, that's why Malsek told her, go seek Geralt of Rivia. Because okay. yeah. that's who she's fated to be with. Okay. That's why all this terrible calamity has befallen. <laughs> Could be. Yeah. Like, he didn't come after her, so. Yeah. yeah. The world is conspiring to get that. Well, I love how it leaves a little bit of room to where it could be or could not be. You know what I mean? Yeah. Why didn't the world just make a monster? Make him come there <laughs> instead of destroying <laughs> this entire country? Well, maybe Nuffgard is the monster. Because, uh, you know. Now it is! <laughs> <laughs> she shouldn't have been so hard on the pass for the Nuffgardian prince. Yeah, that was that yeah, was the quorum could have solved everything. That was a diamond hard pass right there. <laughs> yeah. That was harsh. I, uh, <sighs> I, you know, I really love the queen. I have to say, yeah, she's she's great. She's a great character. She's badass. She's takes no nonsense. Yep, has no time for tradition. She's a warrior. Fate. Yep, she just wants a blade in her hand. Mm-hmm. She only feels alive on the battlefield. Yeah, so good. Uh, and I yeah. love the stuff with Yennefer too. Yeah, she looked really good in her costume now. She's, like, all suited up. Yeah, she's looks cool, she's gorgeous, and just, you know, like, the power she has, it was a really awesome set piece. Just jumping. Oh, yeah. It was like, jump her. Not as good. There's a scene like that in The Witcher 3 where you're just jumping from gorgeous location to gorgeous location over yeah. and over again. Yeah. It reminded me of that. Yeah, that was really cool. And well, Why'd she leave the woman and the baby? I think she's just selfish. Oh, Wanted to survive. Okay, but she then she went back though. She changed her mind, I think. Okay, that's what happened. But I'm not really sure. That fucking chick was talking so much shit to her. Yeah. And then she left her kid to sacrifice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I don't remember that from the books. It's been a while since I've read The Last Wish, but I don't remember that particular section. Yeah, and we found out why they're. There's not really any more witchers anymore because they can't create any more witchers since the sack of something. Um, Kaer Morhen. Okay. Yeah. So, it's not a spoiler. Okay, Kaer, so there are different schools of witchers. Okay. He's School of the Wolf. Okay. And their headquarters was Kaer Morhen, which is like this fortress. Okay. And it got sacked and all of the, like, spells and the trial of the grasses and things. Well, no. Well... I won't say exactly what happened, but... Like, the knowledge is lost, basically. But the knowledge is lost. The technology was lost, okay. but not necessarily... Because he remembers everything that happened to him, right? Geralt? Yeah. But he wouldn't be able to, like, make the potion that made him a witcher. Yes, it's a very advanced formula. Okay. And has a very low success rate. Yeah. Usually kills people. Oh, really? Damn. <clears throat> Only the strong survive. Yeah, just the whole... Wedding thing was cool. So, yeah, so I, I guess I thought that the guy that we know gets killed later with her on the battlefield was the father. But no, I guess that guy died. The queen's original husband died. Yes. Um, after he was saved by Urchin. Yeah. Yeah. And Lord Urchin. Thomas. Yeah, the then first... he died anyways. And he died anyways. Yeah, the first husband's name was... Doesn't really matter. So, wait a minute, wait a minute. I th it's the first thing you see. Like, how does he get... King uh, Roggener. Yeah. How did fucking... It's the first thing you see that you do not expect. So, yeah, l like they said in here, it's something that you have but do not expect. Well, something you, when possess, do you see her? don't know it yet. He saw her right there. Inside, like, inside of her belly. No, no. Well, yeah, but how did Lord Urchin get to be with Pavetta? Like, how's he claiming her? And that's the first thing. Oh, okay. It's because... He came home and his queen was pregnant. Okay. And then he watched her. Or he he was away on campaign and battle and stuff like that, and she had a kid. You can just, I mean, it's, it's a pretty big honor system. Yeah, it is, but you see what happens when you don't fulfill it. Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. I mean, that, that is <laughs> the strong belief in the, the law. Yeah. The law of surprise. Like, if you don't fulfill destiny, then destiny will fulfill you full of swords. <laughs> or, like Geralt says, it's just an honor system, and your word should be your bond, regardless of your class. Yeah. Because, yeah. you know, you, you're taking a risk. Like, you come home, and the surprise could be they had the plague the whole time. <laughs> yeah. And so you get the plague, you know? Yeah, I guess, yeah. It's um. a gamble. 
The fight in the throne room was amazing. Or the, yeah. The, yeah, it was pretty good, yeah. The Great Hall. Really good stuff. I loved how he just appeared and cut that halberd in half. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh, so good. Yeah. And I appreciate that where he cut it was not the reinforced bit because those are specifically made <laughs> to not be cut like that. But he cut it below the uh, the strapping on the side. Yeah. Fight the scenes in the show were just such a blessing. It was good seeing him take a potion as well. Yeah. Yeah. To buff himself up. Mm-hmm. He didn't really change. Normally, if you take too much, like, he becomes more pale. More you can super see his sand. veins. Yeah. He, more it looked like his it looked like his eyes were a brighter yellow. A little bit, yeah. But other it, than that, it, in the games, it's a lot more pronounced. But. Right. <sighs> Mouse captured, and they know where Siri is. But how are they gonna get into that forest? Yeah, the prince definitely seemed very annoyed that she was there, because you don't go in there with an army. <laughs> He seems like the kind of guy who would want to take an army everywhere he goes. <laughs> yeah, he said, so "Damn it!" <laughs> that was so funny. And like the okay, so the when she was drinking that thing from the tree, and then she appeared in that vision. Mm-hmm. It's like, is it the tree? I imagine is some kind of symbol. Symbol, like, like higher the, power. This to be interpreted. And, it, and it, it, it even is wondering what she is. I guess right. Maybe. I don't want to say too much. Okay. All right. Yeah. Well, I love it. I fucking love this show. I want to watch more. I love Jasker as well. Yeah. Like, <laughs> getting the peasants to tell the story, and he just starts singing at the end. Yeah. So good. And just... I love the beginning also, too. Yeah. Yeah, the, the way he was talking and acting mm-hmm. was just very true to character. Yeah. So, That's great. Really good stuff. Really good stuff. Can't wait for the next one. Mm-hmm. Yeah. If you can't wait to the next Witcher, you don't have to. You can go to patreon.com slash blindwave right now. It's a great way to help us out. You can watch the next one now. You can also watch full length of what we do. Good a lot of surprise and what might be there that you might not expect. Uh, yeah, you, you don't get it until, until we see it, right? <laughs> you fucked that up, I think. <laughs>